Hey, what is up guys? I am Hippie. I want to welcome you back to a brand new episode of The Archer Playthrough. I gotta talk a little bit quiet because although my voice is feeling so much better and my throat feels so much better, um, whenever I talk a little bit louder, try to get my pitch up a little bit, it kind of hurts. So we'll just keep it a little bit low and like kind of more deep voice today. So yeah, a couple of things. Um, I just wanted to record one of these because a, uh, like I said, I'm feeling better. I don't know how long it'll last or if I'm, you know, over my cold or if I'm just getting into it or whatever it is. So since I feel good right now, why not record right now? Right. Um, but the other thing is with gavel coming up within the next two days or so, I'll be doing a lot of quest guides, a lot of tutorials, a lot of exploring videos, a lot of Easter eggs, all these type of deals. I plan to try to do five a day. Um, I just don't know how how much time or if any time I'll have to do to work on the Archer playthrough um, or what this is going to turn into the Gavel playthrough. Uh, I just don't really know, you know, when I'll be able to film that. It could be almost a month before we see it again. Um, so I want to record it. I want to give it like, not just a, oh, it just ended. I want to give it like, this is a nice video where we talk about how awesome this Archer playthrough has been and how much it's meant to me this series so far. And that way, when it turns into the Gavel playthrough, it's not just like we're throwing it away or it's not just disappearing or whatever. Um, it's kind of like, oh yeah, he, he set that thing up, took it to the sun and back. And that thing rode steady, right? So, I've had a ton of fun doing this. Um, just getting to hang out and grind with you guys has been so awesome. I almost lost the spirit for Windcraft. With the update, I was like, man, I just, I can't do it no more. I can't play Windcraft. It almost turned into like a chore for me to do. I was like, oh, all right, I gotta go record Windcraft. But now it's like, yay, I get to record some Windcraft today. So, it's really awesome that it's kind of completely lifted my spirits for the game, brought me back to where it needs to be and where it should be, and got me in this really good place for Gavel. So, I'm really happy that I've gotten to do this. I'm really happy that you guys have uh, joined me on this, I think, what, 40 part episode? Or 40 part series? Man, what a good time, right? So, I had something that I can't believe actually has lined up. This has been the biggest wait for anything I've ever seen in my life to come back together to the same point and it not being that big of a deal. You know, sometimes you're like, oh, you do something serious way back in your childhood and it affects you way later not being able to get a job or something like that. But this is just like... Not serious at all, but so incredible that it's come back to it. So I got to start it off uh, about a year ago, uh, just under a year ago, I found a channel of this guy who was, I think, in his 70s, and he was playing Minecraft, and I was so impressed by this. I was like, how is this guy, and he was like really good at parkour and everything. He wasn't just no chump player or anything. He was a legit good player. And I was like, man, this is insane. I always thought of Minecraft as being a kid's game. So I started searching for videos just to see how much, like, how many old people, I guess you could call them that. It's rude to call them that. But how many elderly people play Minecraft? And I came across a series back then. I didn't watch a whole lot of it. Um, but I think I got about five episodes in so it was about um two and a half three hours one night i was watching it and it was called two old guys and it was these two older older top guys that were uh just playing minecraft and just having a good time they were really funny they were really entertaining i really liked them um and then something happened either i just you know went to bed and woke up and forgot about it or I lost it from my search history. I can't quite remember. Anyway, I found that I didn't watch anymore. That was it. I didn't get their um, 
usernames or their names or uh, their channel or any of that stuff. At the time, I didn't even have the uh, title of the videos, but I have it now. So I was like, man, that's, that's crazy that there's these older type people. Now, fast forward to about huh, maybe three months ago. Yeah, about three months ago, I was on Twitter and I found a tweet from Doc M from the Minecraft Network. Oh, my nose is a little stuffy. I apologize. And I found Lanky White Guy, who was building the guitars. And then I found out that he played Minecraft too. I was like, this guy plays Minecraft too, and this guy's like a genuine, like real cool hippie. Um, so I was kind of surprised again. I was like, man, this is. This is awesome that it's not just a kid's game and that I don't have to be like, oh man, I'm getting old or I've got to stop playing Minecraft or anything like that. I'm like, man, these, these guys have kids and, and um, you know, they're all older type dudes and like, they're not just like, no, oh, sit around and play game type dudes. These guys have like, um, like legit full-time jobs and stuff and they're still making time to play Minecraft. I'm like, that's not just this oh just random thing that's like a legitimate that's like a legitimate uh dedication to the game so i was like that's really cool um and i've been watching lanky as much as i possibly can since every once in a while i get just so caught up on youtube that i'm not able to go and watch his videos i just found out that he cut off all his hair i haven't uh from when i started watching he still had long hair so i'm not sure how long he's had it but he cut it all real short and i was like oh my god um, but just today, actually about 20 minutes ago, I was, uh, able to catch the back end of, um, Lanky's live stream. And, uh, of course there were some of the people I recognized from his streams and recognized from the Oak and Stone and people like that. I recognized Oat and, uh, Dragoon and stuff like that. Um... But there was a guy in there that I'd, I'd never seen from there. And so I started talking and I asked him if he had... Oh, hold on one second here. Something's going on. One second, let me get up high. I will be right back. <laughs> okay. Sorry about that. Uh, I may be one of the most easily spooked people in the world. And I, I try not to admit that. But um, my phone vibrating on the table just freaked me out because I didn't know what it was. Okay. So back to what I was saying. Um... I was in Linky's uh, Skype, and I was t or not Skype, his uh, live stream, and I was talking to uh, a guy named Durandal, and uh, they were talking about the server and stuff like that, and I was like, I don't think I've ever heard of Durandal. I've heard of all these other guys. I'm like, do you, do you have a YouTube channel? Um, got the YouTube channel, went and played his latest video. I wanted to see how the quality was and stuff like that. And right away, for some reason, the voice, like, reminded me of something. I'm like, man, what is this? This guy just sounds, um, just sounds really familiar. And then I asked, I was like, you didn't happen, uh, to be recording a series with another feller back about a year ago, did you? And it turns out, I discovered that this guy... <laughs> is one of those two guys that recorded these videos that I watched a year ago. I was like, how have I somehow found myself back to this guy's channel after so long? Right. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that, I had a cough. Um, how could I find my way back to this guy's channel after so long? So, um, you know, I made sure I subscribed this time so I could find it again. And then it turns out that the other guy that was in that series way back when is another guy that I've just started watching now. Uh, so I made sure to subscribe today. I'm like, how how crazy is this that it's that it's added up? Um, so the other guy's name is Wydoc. Uh, and he's been in a lot of, um, a lot of those videos. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of a server called Dadcraft. It's a, 
uh, a smaller server with the all these guys who are all dads and uh, they started the server they have these really amazing builds on there though um, and I was just so shocked that I was able to find it again but I thought about it um, all of these guys have uh, some relatively smaller channels I would like to try to do my best to con convince you guys and persuade you guys to check them out but I'm not just gonna send you guys over saying oh you guys need to subscribe because I watch their videos what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna tell you this all of these channel links that I've put in the description all of them upload really nice content okay their video quality is better than mine their audio quality is better than mine and their content is pretty dang good they're all funny they're all entertaining I haven't felt like I've reached any point in almost all of these videos. I'd say about 99% of the videos I can watch straight through without saying like, oh man, this is a low point. Every once in a while it'll be like, oh man, it's a little bit quiet here or something like that. But other than that, it's straight content. Like, uh, most of these guys play a lot of survival or um, multiplayer servers or... Um, I've noticed uh, quite a few adventure maps. Uh, one of the things that I see quite often is UHCs, which is pretty awesome because I love UHC. I watch the Minecraft UHCs. However, they upload UHC, what, every six to eight months? These guys have already watched, I think, three or four UHCs just on Lanky's channel. So um, I would recommend that you check them out. I'm going to leave the descriptions in the description sorry my head's a little foggy from medicine I'm gonna leave in the description a link to all of these guys' channel I don't know how many it's gonna be I haven't counted it yet but I know it's gonna be quite a few I would like for you guys to check them out if you enjoy their content then I would like for you guys to subscribe if you do subscribe you can drop a comment um, letting them know where you came from because uh, if enough of you guys subscribe, they might be a little confused as to where everybody's coming from. So uh, you guys can just let them know. Um, yeah, I sent you guys over. But uh, yeah, like I said, not all, not, none of these guys play Windcraft. But uh, I do know that there's a small portion of you guys that watch my survival and that you guys watch my PvP type stuff. And um, if you guys want to go check it out, then really good survival, really good builds cool stuff they're playing on 1.9 in an amplified uh, server it looks so beautiful and they're doing really awesome stuff so yeah so many uh, channels you can go check out I'll leave them all down below and you can go check them out if you would like um, spread the Christmas spirit spread the Christmas joy by a subscriber here and there uh, I think that's oh man I think that's about it I don't want to wrap it up because I know that when I wrap this one up, there's a good chance that it's going to be the last Archer playthrough. Oh, it's so sad. I'm not even going to lie. I'm being completely honest. I'm genuinely sad. Um, but I know that, you know, it's not going away. It's just transforming into the Gavel playthrough eventually. But, man. I'm a sad dog, you guys. A real sad dog, I tell you. I think that's about it for now. Um, I tell you what, it'd be really nice if somebody went and edited up a montage of Archer playthrough videos. No, no, I'm just kidding. Uh, play a sad montage of Archer playthrough with, like, violin in the background. No, 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 no. That is not how this series would go out. If this series went out like that, it would be the chumpiest thing of all time. This series goes out playing like death metal in the background and like throwing your fist into the air and all kinds of stuff like that that's how we're gonna ride out into the sunset fellers I tell you what look straight to the sky and run I gotta wrap up though now cuz I'm just stalling I gotta rip the band-aid that's gonna do it though for now thank you guys so much for watching the last Archer playthrough I have been hippie and I will see you guys next time